to my YouTube channel. I am Riviana, and today I have this new MCAP wig for you guys sent from OQ Hair. Now this is my very first time working with this hair company and I'm actually very pleased with their wig unit. Not only that, this is my very first time with receiving a MCAP wig as well, you guys. So I actually got this wig unit in a kinky straight texture and I believe that this is a 26 inch. So you guys, I'm really pleased with the quality of the hair along with the curl pattern. So I have reviewed quite a few of Blueless wig units, you guys. However, I do think that this one has more of the advantage because of that MCAP construction. So even though this wig is being marketed as pre-plug, pre-bleach, pre-cut, all of those types of things, this one definitely has a more comforting ear and I do have a smaller head and I always feel like the wigs do kind of sit on top of my ear. So I love that they have that type of construction with their wig cap. And also this one has a nine by six lace to it. So here is like a picture of the cap that they use for this, you guys. And also you can see the C-shaped ear design as well here. I don't know if you guys could tell, but it definitely has like a curve to it so that your ear, so it can sit a little bit more comforting on your ear. These are removable combs and all you have to do is literally like pull them out and you can just put them right back into their holes with ease. And I love that they actually give you some more just in case you lose them. But I absolutely really do love this wig cap construction, you guys. Love the big parting space. And also it does come with an additional elastic band. And I do have my elastic band in now. And also I think that this wig unit is actually like half the price of these of blueless wig units that's being marketed these days so i recommend if you guys are like looking for budget friendly wig units quality budget friendly wig units i definitely recommend you guys try out any mcap wigs that you guys see try them out you guys because their cap construction is amazing and i just feel like that's just what really makes a really good wig unit on top of it being completely blueless i do not have any blue adhesive sprays or anything on this wig unit and i can literally like place this right under and literally go straight through and i'm also able to lift it up for you guys and place my wig right back down. Okay, so I've already went in and curled to find this wig unit and I did a little parting. I didn't go too far back with it, but do a little bit. And this is the hair. So I do actually have this wig unit parted on the actual side, you guys. So that's one thing. Just trying to make sure I move my hairs out of the way from under the cap so it can lay seamlessly on my head. And taking my ears out. And we're going to put the combs in, in the back. I actually have it fitted comfortably on my head as well. And I do want to put some heat to the hairline so that you guys could see it a bit better. Okay, so this is the hairline of this wig unit. Literally, all you have to do is pop this wig right on. Especially after you have curl defined your hair, it will be super easy for you to put this wig unit on. Now I am gonna to try to do a little bit more parting for you guys so that you can see it. I'm gonna take this 
Ruby Kisses. I have this in the color 15. This is a cream based foundation. I normally use my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation. It's drying. I find that this one is creamy so it's not really like a matte. So I was just kind of like spraying like spritz in it to give it a stick. But hey, right? <laughs> so I'm going to use this lighter color and do my party that way. I don't know, I'm gonna take a little bit of this foundation in the darker tone because I do have my contour. I'm gonna just dab it on there.